<laughs> so we are studying the game with activities, uh, and today uh, we're going to get to know each other, you're going to learn about us, what we do, where we are, hear our stories, and how to get to wall, and how to connect with us. So hi, my name is Nicole, and we're actually going to start with like a small activity, so just with like the people around you, like three or four people. Um, you can share your name, what your prospective major is, um, activities and some of activities and events that you're interested in joining in, in, on campus already, and if there's any clubs you want to join or if you don't, don't have it already, if you are interested in creating a club on campus. We'll do that for like three minutes. <laughs>
Well, it's all on our website. Um, and it's all different, but yeah, we'll talk about it. Yeah. Okay, so uh, we are student centered organization and we create space for students to promote open dialogue. Uh, we support diverse programs and we promote interconnected community. Uh, and we are also uh, diverse people this year. Yeah, so CSA is a department that basically links students to resources and organizations that help create the relationships with the students. And it's, uh, we have clubs and organizations and activities and events that help enhance people's college experiences on the campus. And we'll go over like exactly who we are in a bit. Yeah, so we are basically creating environments for students to be extraordinary. Um, we are student-driven dri and student-centered. We help students navigate the sense of belonging and build community through various programs, and we support students to develop their identities and their skills. So um, we have our professional staff, and they provide support, mentorship, and assistance, and, and access to valuable student resources. And we have ASU WB, or Student Government, uh, they're supporting and drafting policy that promotes students' interests, needs, and welfare. Um, they serve as liaison between uh, students, faculty, staff, and alumni. Then we have our ACWB Elections Committee, and they basically just run the election process for students who are running for ACWB. And campus events boards, they host events and promote student interactions on campus. And then we have club councils, so if you're interested in starting a club or you're in a club, uh, they help start new clubs, find clubs to join, and provide club clubs to clubs. And then we have even cultural coordinators, they create events that share different cultures. And then we have the project assistants, which is us, and we provide support to professional staff and the, all the student organizations. <laughs> and we have social justice organizers, we were just learning about social justice. So, that organization is to raise awareness about social issues and in the society through open dialogue and creative workshops. And then we have our student media, so we, uh, we have U-Wave, Husky, Herald, and Clamor, and they all provide hands-on experience through different media, such as publication, broadcasting, photography, video, all that. So we are located in the art. I'm pretty sure you all know where the art is. Um, we are the first floor, right when you get in, and um, so we are in Idaho of 130 And so about us, my name is Dragana. I'm originally from Bosnia and Herzegovina, not Russia. Probably most of people have to I um, transferred here from North Seattle Community College in 2017. I'm a major in supply chain management, and so far, my involvement in campus, um, I attended uh, all and outdoor wellness events. I, uh, Jewish Student Success Center and uh, Writing and Communication Center. Uh, and I also started my own club, Supply Chain Management Club, here on campus. Uh, why it matters to be involved in campus? It's first because you want to develop your uh, personal uh, and professional skills. Uh, you improve your skills, expand your network, which is really important in, like, when you start looking for internships and jobs, it's really important to build that network. Um, you'll build your resume. It's always important to put in your resume to have leadership experience, like a lot of companies care about that. Uh, you learn from professionals also, and also because college is not all about studying exams. For the exams. <laughs> and I'm Nicole. Um, so this is my second year at UW Paul I graduated from Redmond High School, so not that far away from here. Um, I was first interested in majoring in biology, and now my intended major is law and office of public policy. And my first year, I actually wasn't as involved on campus because I was still trying to find my way around. Um, I did go to a lot of the intramural sport events, like there was soccer, football, volleyball. So if you're interested in joining those, we can also help you with that later. Um, and I did go to some of the uh, Taiwanese events that were on campus, and I joined the biology club at first, that was my intended major. Um, and then this year, it's mostly been working as a project assistant and being able to go to some of the events, such as Lunar New Year, um, that was last night, and fun stuff like that. So. And then, my, so very similar to what Dragon has said, um, working here or being more involved on campus has allowed me to meet people from different backgrounds and actually communicate with them, um, learning different, their different cultures, improving your job skills, creating a network to build your resume, um, for internships later on and jobs, and you grow as a person too. 
skip Venice since she's not here. Okay, so how to get involved. So, so imagine you can start or join the club. We have almost 100 clubs here on campus from academic clubs, cultural, religious, visual, literary, and performing arts, anything you can think of. And if there's clubs that um, you're interested in but you don't have it, that's great opportunity for you all to start the club. Um, you can also attend all the events that we have, like last night, Lunar New Year, concerts, and other events that are happening. Uh, you can get on campus job. I would ignore these two openings because we hire those people. But like in April, make sure to look up if you're interested in working on campus. In April is a big hiring event uh, where they hire all the C staff, so social justice organizers, ICCs, projects assistants. So like that's that's a good time to look for a position on campus if you're interested in that. I'm not sure if they put on handshake our for us, but maybe they do also so probably and you can also volunteer for events. Yeah, so these are just some pictures of past events we've had. Um, we had W Day this year, but everyone was moving in on campus, and then we had from Sorry, Heritage Night, um, yeah, and Lunar New Year last year. So, um, and also um, the Halloween event that we had. So, and Soul Train. <laughs> So we have a lot of events on campus, um, and we're always posting about them around to advertise and tell y'all to come, and so they're fun, so always come. So, so these are all the ways you can connect with us. Um, if you're interested, I know if, if any of you, are you in any of the clubs yet, or you're planning to join? You are in the club already? Okay. Yeah, so you know how to find clubs and everything. Okay. Yeah, so if you go on our webpage, you'd have to be the DDU slash C. You know, and that's like Facebook and Instagram is where we'll post like um, events that will be coming up or hiring positions and all the stuff to be just for you guys to be updated on. Um, and there's all this on there and we constantly update. Yeah, so if you go on our webpage, you can see all the clubs that are in there. Feel free to join any of them. Do you have any questions for us? Or if you think of any questions, feel free to email us at uwc at uw.edu. We'll be happy to answer all your questions and help you get some leadership skills. Yeah, thank you so much. Hi, class, I'll see you back in our class. Everybody else is <laughs> 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 <laughs>